All right, let's check this place out. With Strickland. Wait, as in Mr. Strickland? Away from the door. Yeah, settle down, boy. Let me get a look at you. Who are you calling a who? Einstein, come on. Just as I suspected. Boy. Hooligan. Who are you calling a hooligan? What? Yeah, I'm no hooligan. I'm not a hooligan, ma'am. I'm a, a teenager. <laughs> I wasn't born yesterday, young man. Aren't you the miscreant who skateboards through the town square every morning between 8 and 8.30 in a decidedly unpunctual <laughs> manner? Uh, yeah. Okay, that's a bit creepy. All skateboarders are hooligans. It's a fact. Look it up. <laughs> Did you hear that, Tony Hawk? <laughs> Anyone who ever has ridden a skateboard is a hooligan. You heard it here on in, from, uh... Miss Strickland. Yeah. Who are you? I just gave it away, but, uh... You aren't yeah. related to, uh, Vice Principal Strickland, are you, ma'am? Uh-huh. Not that it's any of your business, but I'm his sister, Edna. <laughs> oh, and you're one of those McFly slackers, aren't you? Ah. Uh, uh, what's old man Strick... I mean, <laughs> what else has your brother been saying about me? Nothing I... You just wait till he hears about that. <laughs> Einstein brought me here. Stay your business, child. You're making me miss Merv. Merv. <laughs> See, that's the thing. I'm not sure why I'm here. Einstein here brought me, and... Well? <laughs> I've got something for you. Can you let me in? I've got something to show you. What is it? Let me see. So now you once again gotta pick the shoe. And then choose her. A shoe? Wow, now what would I want with a... Huh? <gasps> Stay there! <laughs> she has the other shoe. But obviously it's much, much older. <laughs> Down, boy. Leave that creature outside. Stay here, Sorry, Einstein. Einstein. <laughs> Aw, that's a good boy. Good boy, Einstein. <laughs> yeah. Well, took you long enough. What? Um, there's a lot of stairs. Yeah, there was a lot of stairs. the shoe, I mean. Oh. I lost it ages ago. Really? You can put it down next to the other one. And when exactly would that was that? Much better. So huh. neat and orderly. Now I suppose you'll be wanting some sort of reward now. No. no. All I've got is tea and candy. But I'm sorry I called you a hooligan. I try not to jump to conclusions, but after all, nine out of ten people in this city are hooligans. Wow. It's a <laughs> fact. Look it up. No, it's not. <laughs> uh, Have a seat, Sonny. Uh, no, I, I think I'm okay. <laughs> Yeah, apparently that's what she does. <laughs> ah, momentarily froze on me there. <laughs> well, it's saved. Cat bowls? Oh, ooh, yeah, pictures. Let's look at pictures. <laughs> Is that Vice Principal Strickland? Mother <laughs> never could keep little Gerald out of her clothes. <laughs> Oh, uh, the, the Mr. Strickland that we saw from the movies. Wow. You always talk to the siblings about the truth about them. They always have those little hilarious secrets. Let's look at some Marshall more pictures. Strickland. My grandfather, gunned down by Mad Dog Tannen over a hundred years ago. Ah. That's not how I remember it. Yeah, that's not how I remember it either. Remember from the third movie? 
Jeez. They all look like they've got sticks up there. What's that? <laughs> nothing. Uh, uh, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Can I look at another? Jeez. Uh, nope. What's that? Nope. 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 Cat bowls? Oh, I wouldn't oh. do that if I were you. Ms. Pretty Whiskers is very particular about who handles Ms. Pretty the Whiskers? Okay. Let's see. Candy. Oh, the candy looks older than I am. Yeah, I wouldn't try that. Ugh. Cat trophies? Really? Oh, My editorial trophies. What? Cat Lovers Quarterly. It's legitimate journalism. <laughs> okay. Let's the shoes. Einstein brought me that shoe from the past. But when in the past? Oh. <laughs> oh man. Uh let's see. The kitchen door. Uh Miss Strickland, about your tea. Yeah. I forgot to turn you! on the <laughs> Alright, oh man, I wonder if, how many you guys, how, how many people watching that go, Hey, I know someone like that in my neighborhood. <laughs> the newspapers? Don't touch those. Oh, oh. My newspapers are in pristine condition. And really? Meticulously organized. They're stacked up on top of each other. street punk get jam all over them. Jam? <laughs> Really? That is organized? They're all stacked up on top of each other like that. Huh. Let's talk to her. Uh, Miss Strickland? Jack! Diane! I know what you're doing behind that tree! We're, ju we're just having a conversation! Yes. Nothing else! <laughs> What's with all these newspapers? What's with all these newspapers? This is my personal archive. I've got every issue of the Hill Valley Telegraph ever published. Get out. Every single issue? From 1871 to the present. Yikes. If it happened in Hill Valley, you'll find it in my stacks. <laughs> okay. When did you lose that shoe? Do you remember when you lost your shoe? Shoe? That shoe over the there. one I brought you. Oh, that shoe. Yeah. Hi, what a nosy Nelly. No one likes a busybody. Hey, you know. I'm just curious. But, oh, fine. Let me think about it. Uh, yes, I, I remember. I, I lost it in a scuffle with a, a dog. Uh huh. When was it? Oh, yes. The day that speakeasy burned down. Wait, what? <laughs> A speakeasy? In Hill Valley? Don't act so surprised, young man. Your generation doesn't hold a copyright on moral depravity, you know. Huh. Yeah. Sin has been on the prowl in Hill Valley since the day it was founded. Uh-huh. <laughs> the illegal speakeasy? Cool! Wow, a speakeasy. That must have been wild. Is it true they used to drink gin out of slippers like my grandma said? Huh. Don't romanticize the past, young man. Prohibition was a time when gangsters ruled the town while honest citizens quaked in their beds. Nah, see? Nah. <laughs> and where exactly was that speakeasy? So where was it? That speakeasy that burned down, I mean. That was ages ago. If you're looking for bootleg hooch... No. No, I I'm just curious, that's all. I'm a, a student of history. Nice. Student of history? My Aunt Fanny! <laughs> yeah, you generation of hooligans and Oh, come on! Don't you write things about history? Miss Strickland? Come oh, on. Video store! Huh? The speakeasy used to be hidden in plain sight down there in the town square. Right really? Where that disgusting videotape rental store squats today. Oh, the video store building okay. must have gone up after the speakeasy burned down. The following year, as I recall. So a year after where Doc is. 
So, let's see. How about... You know, those are some nice binoculars. Doing some stargazing? Oh, I set my sights on the lower things. Is that... <laughs> Chip Tannen! Get away from that hubcap before I call your father! <laughs> I guess that's Biff's brother? Don't let me keep you from your business. <laughs> you there! Don't even think about tossing that Kleenex on the ground! Okay. <laughs>